I want to wait for 292 commercial space, large parking. Large parking is filed for renewal of its conditional sure. use permit for open air parking for a 69 space parking lot. Hi. Good evening. Thank you, Council. Thank you uh, very much for uh, having us on short for having me on such a short notice. Uh, my name is Todd Gilbert. I represent Lands Parking, um, and also I am a, a resident of the North End. Um, uh, I have the special service class. Thank you. Do you need As well as our neighbor's notification. Um, so, Land Parking is a parking management firm. We've been in business 30 plus years. Um, started in Boston and in Hartford, Connecticut, and it's grown to be a national company. Um, we've been in the North End at this 290, 282-92 Commercial Street lot for about 25 years. Um, after it was uh, it was previously a gas station, then it was zoned for uh, under conditional use for um, a parking lot. 69 spaces. It is a valet assist lot um, that is open seven days a week. We cater to many residents, um, patrons of the North End, and as well as business owners. Um, it's uh, we are only at we're not uh, seeking any additional. Um, Zoning relief just to continue continuation of the current use of premise um, until I believe it is 2014. It's a three year term. Um, and I'm not here today to seek uh, the council support as well as the, uh, the neighborhood. How many days a week did you say? Seven days. Oh, okay. seven days. I believe the last time you appeared before our council was, I know that was obviously for a much different issue. Correct. It had to do with making improvements. Yes, actually, yeah, I was going to mention that. Uh, some of you remember me from a year ago, the 588 Commercial Street lot, uh, where we did some site, well, we were new to that lot. We looked to do some site improvements. Um, I'm happy to say that that uh, went through successfully. I hope that the neighborhood is happy with what we did. Um, I think it was a vast improvement from the previous proprietor of that lot. Um, and we, I know we are certainly happy with the final result, um, but I'd like to hear comments and suggestions if anyone has a, for that lot or the current lot at 290 um, you know last you know we've, we've been a partner with the North End for a long time we look to to you know continue that for, for even longer so um, I know I've spoken to a lot of people personally just from being a resident myself I have a vested interest being a resident parking at the lot myself um, so I think that is a benefit to to, uh, to both the neighborhood and Certainly myself. Do you guys sell zip cars? We do. We have zip car, and we actually um, have a corporation called Mint, which is trying to break into the market. Same concept as zip car. So we, we technically have two different services and four different shared shared um, rental um, vehicles in the lot. So uh, there's two zip cars and two Mint cars. Oh, it doesn't come up. I 290? Oh, really? I used to It's pretty popular. I, I don't know. I can't speak to the other their competitor. Uh, I think they rotate vehicles, so I don't, I don't know for certain. Yeah. I know their, their vehicles are. It's a red central. Yeah, they are pretty uh, fuel efficient vehicles. Whether or not that grows or expanded between the roads or I don't think that it doesn't affect this at all. Or What's that? That part of this use that we're voting on that it Yeah, I mean it at all or no Yeah, we, we you know, to, to have it as a continue to operate as a parking lot that is zip car. No, it's okay, yeah. They just rent the so parking. They could decide. Yeah, they just rent the parking. Yeah. yeah. They rent the parking for another yeah. reason and they put their cars in, people take them out. Which is a great service. A lot of people use it in the neighborhood. If you don't have a car, I don't want to have a special car. It's good. I know people that use it. At the yeah, it's very, it's very popular. Very popular. You said the permit is for a two-year term. It's a three-year term. Three so we're currently, it's expired um, almost a year now. So we'll be coming before you again in two more years. So, yeah, you always have to keep um, continuing. So. What are the fees for renovating? I'm sorry? What's the cost of renovating for you then? Cost of renewing oh, it? Renewing your fees. Uh, I don't. I think it's just time and three hundred dollars fee to the city. Um, but you know, it's 
if you have attorneys and what, that's where the real cost yeah. is. But I think the, the, the paperwork piece is, is a nominal charge. Mm -hmm. That's a good question about the zip cards, because that really is not before us. What's before us is only the renewal of your additional permit to have the parking for another three years. Right. No, I know, but I yeah, think no, it no, adds, no, it adds to the use of the, of the parking lot. It's not just the parking lot that provides spaces in the neighborhood to park your car, which are key, I think. Right, right. But right. it also offers another additional service, which is to lower the amount of cars that are parked in the street by offering zip cars. That's right. That's right. exactly right. And it's very well it. kept, too. I don't know if you guys walk on by this next to the funeral home, and it's across from the... Yep, that's awesome. Uh, that's awesome. It looks better than it did in the past. Well, thank you. That's that's good to hear. I'm always in that area. Anyway. Yeah, yeah. We, we really uh, went through. Uh, I personally went through a lot to 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 get that um, to get those site renovations in place. And and, and I you know personally I I think it, it, it looks a lot better. I believe too that parking is a huge issue in the North End. And any parking space that's available, that is you know we would rather have parking there than a building. So I think it's a good thing. This is not the that That's this one. Oh, yes. Okay. Yes. Any other council yeah, members? Like got you got um, we've recently uh, gotten bike lanes in the north end. We've mm -hmm. got the hubway system now. Are you, are you guys, do you have any? I have noticed, I use that also. I use mostly the perimeter space along the, the harbor near that lot. I haven't noticed any bike um, facilities. Are there any bike uh, lot and posts or like that? It's across, across the street. The street. Um, no, I'm talking about, you know, for, for your your uh, customers who might drive a lot and then bike to uh, you know, work some distance away, do you have yeah. any sort of intermodal? We, we don't, uh, not at that lot. Um, is that something you can consider? Because we're trying to become somewhat more bike sensitive here. It's certainly something to consider. I mean, um, driving a few posts uh, into the, you know, concreting them into the, into the surrounding area of the parking lot could help people who want to have sort of a dual uh, commute. One yeah. driving from the suburbs and one biking to, say, uh, the the voltage triangle areas. Yeah. yeah, I mean, consider. Certainly it sort of adds to the to the, bis the, the renewed bicycle awareness we have in the neighborhood. Yeah. The other issue is that to me that lot is is due for a resurfacing. It seems like it's that's really correct. I've actually put that into my budget for the 2012 year. So it definitely needs it needs some work. Um, it needs to be some of the concrete needs to be milled and, and set, and probably a seal coat. Uh, you know, on a repaint. That's the only, you know, work that we foresee doing or having done. Uh, we did recently do some patching, and we, there's a drain that rests in that lot that was once a, a large issue with, with, with holding, pulling water. Uh, we were able to fix that, which was good, um, and do some light improvements and various um, touch-ups of the lot. So. When do you plan on doing the resurfacing? Um, I, I don't know. You yeah. know, probably in the spring. I would, I would think. Any other council members? Any questions? Any folks out here have any questions, comments? Go Sir, ahead. This is Just a second, Phil. Uh, Tony Mateo, I own 309 North Street, which yep. is next to the sidewalk, the building, the old building. Yes, sir. I, I would recommend that maybe put some of those tall, large cones up against that wall so when the ties fall. Yep. They don't get you know, uh, too close to that. Yes, sir. But outside of that, uh, I don't know him, but uh, the guys that work his lot, uh, they really take care of the lot. They're very good with the uh, neighbors and uh, the tenants that I have. And uh, even though my tenants aren't here, uh, they were all informed by letter by him, and they all feel like I need everybody for a lot. Yeah, would you comment a little bit on the neighborhood notice? Uh, yes, ma'am. We notified all the abutters, um, I'll give you the addresses, uh, 293, 295, 301, 305, and 309 North Street, as well as uh, the Four Winds Bar and Grill and the uh, 300 Commercial Street building, um, the Mariner <coughs> building. Um, I sent the letter that I submitted to you on the desk there, um, and um, that was done on December 1st. Bill? Oh, you did? Okay. Neil? Yeah, Neil Denenberg at 300 Commercial Street. This one, I didn't know what this was all about, but it's where I park and uh, bringing a lot of my clients into the parking lot. And you run a wonderful parking lot. And I really enjoy your people at this game to support. Oh, thank you, Neil. Thank you. Appreciate that. Thank you. Okay. Victor? Yeah, Victor Brown. Uh, I assume the application is to the Boston Park. 
Uh, inspectional services. Oh. Yeah. And then we go before the boarding, uh, the, the uh, Board of Appeals, the Zoning Board of Appeals. Ah. Yeah. Yes, go ahead. Hi, Kelleher, I'm 305 North Street. Um, I would also just like to just shut up. Uh, we see the letter in support of the parking lot. Um, like the second, the, the comment that parking is such a big issue in North End and being a, um, a direct father and neighbor of lives, uh, you know, we're definitely in support with two small kids. Uh, uh, they're, they're a great option uh, to deal with the, uh, the problems of finding spots, and especially being a neighbor, it's nice to be able to. to uh, Park and short term, as well as um, issues on the weekend, or when we have major parking issues. So, uh, definitely in, in support of um, more parking spaces and, and keeping the slot going. So. Thank you. Just to clarify what Victor was asking, um, the reason for this appeal is the appeal seeks permission to allow the appellant to extend the use of an existing parking for a fee parking lot beyond the previously approved expiration date of January 31st, 2011. So it has to be renewed, and so it's just a <coughs> process that you have to go through. Correct. And they go through, he has to go back to the Zoning Board of Appeals, we'll have to write a letter saying whether we support this or not. Does that answer that for you, Victor? Yes, thanks. Yeah, okay. Any other questions from anybody? Comments? You've got My comment is just like, what, they're the only lot that's come in front of us since uh, the Everyone, I'm assuming, is having to renew this license every two years. Is that true? Uh, this is a conditional. I think some have. An, uh, this is a conditional use, which yeah. might make a difference. Yeah, so they, you, it you comes. Came, you came to us a few years ago. I think the landlord wanted to. No, the questions Jonathan has is how come other parking lots are just the only on the table? Yeah, but he's got a conditional use, and that's why this permit so is for a period use. of time. Okay. Yeah, so he has to renew it. The portal plan has a conditional use for the parking lot. The, the lot that came before you last year, um, that use of premise is not, it has no, that was a, a different project yes. and that was a one time thing. So, that, you know, I don't think that would come before the board again. This, this is something that will be continuous um, as long as it exists as being a parking lot. So, okay. good yeah. question Jonathan's asking. I don't know how many other parking But that other lot, you wouldn't have to come because you know that other lot well, right? You yeah, don't so have use for that, so you wouldn't have to renew it. No, right, right. That was, so uh, that was a construction ways. project, was why we. But I'm saying, like, generally. Like, Several. Every parking no. lot in the city has to refile on their time frame. You don't have to necessarily go to the unit. Okay. There was a firm that they have to obtain every so many years. All we know. Anybody else? Are we ready to? Any council members? Any? Can, I ready to Can I make a motion? Can I make a motion to support uh, 280-292 commercial streets, less parking? Uh, and they are filing for renewal of this conditional use permit for open air parking, 69 space parking lot. No second. Okay. All in favor? Unanimous, congratulations. Thank you very much. Thank you for providing your service to us in the North End. I appreciate it. Thank you very much for coming yeah. forward. Um, we, we always have uh, time for open discussion at the end. Does anybody have any comments, questions, anything I'd like to mention to the council or ask the council? Okay, then the meeting is adjourned. Thank you all for coming. Thanks for your interest. What do you think, Phil?